Hey guys, it's Tyler Lund. I'm with Veris Technologies, and we're here talking about the eye scan. This is actually a bit more advanced than the typical eye scan that we've released in the past. It's called the eye scan plus. We've added moisture and temperature sensors in addition to electrical conductivity, which is the texture map. And we've also got organic matter sensors. So you as a farmer, when you add this to your planter or your field cultivator, strip till machine, and you're going through the field, you're now collecting two different types of sets. We're getting those long-term soil properties that can help with management zones, better seeding rates, sampling maps. But now we're mapping and getting instant feedback on the temperature and moisture, those field conditions that when we're getting that information right away, we can manage the implement better in the field so we can set it at the right depth. If it's too cold, we can get out of the field. We, if we're on the field cultivator, we can make sure we're getting that last pass done right and informing the planter where to be and when to be. We're doing that with a moisture sensor. This is a capacitance sensor. It's the gold standard in moisture sensing. This has been researched by universities, by government. This is the best way to do moisture. This is on moisture probes. We're the first company to make it on the go. And so it is a very reliable way to get moisture information. You can see it housed here. It's running wherever you set it, in between one to three inches depth to be able to get that moisture sensed right where you want it measured. We're measuring electrical conductivity through an array that goes down two feet, so we're getting a, a good picture of what that rooting profile looks like. And then we have our organic matter sensor back here, which gives a reliable picture of the, the OM. In the cab, You'll be able to see the, the values in addition to a map and gauges and have preset alarms if you're getting into too wet a ground or too dry so that you can get that feedback right in the cab. We're definitely wanting to make sure the farmers are getting that, those, those zones right for their seeding rates and, and inputs, but also getting that information so they can make better decisions the day they're in the cab. If you're a service provider and, and you've got growers who, uh, bigger farmers maybe aren't hiring you to come out and do soil mapping, but they, they really want that data, this is a great way as a service provider to get this data collected. Selling this, renting it to your farmer, allowing them to be involved in the data collection. Uh, it serves a couple purposes. It makes it easier to get over the acres. It's more affordable data collection. And it really allows the farmer to see the variability themselves. They're in the cab seeing the data be collected and when they see that map being built they're they're recognizing yeah this is that poor spot and they're getting it digitized and they start to get more and more excited about the maps and about the services that you can provide them so uh, it, it gets them involved in the process.